around. I just can't get around it like I used to. My grandmother has congestive heart failure. She's had it for a few years now. She initially had a pacemaker and had uh, AFib. So what, what typically, typically happens is um, either she's the shortness of breath or um, we notice that she's gained several pounds in a short, um, sh short amount of time and that usually has led us to the emergency room. She's been admitted to that through the emergency room three times. Now the cardiac direct access unit is something that the cardiology division developed to address the needs of people who have urgent cardiac needs, whether it be evaluation of new symptoms, chest pain, or shortness of breath, and it gives them a place to go other than the emergency room and directly see a cardiologist. She went to the uh, CDAC once as an outpatient. They adjusted her meds, her fluid pills, and then she went home. And then most recently, um, she had a little bit too much fluid, so they kept her as an observation patient for one night, and we were able to take her home the next day. It's, it's almost like an urgent care unit. For my grandmother, it's a great opportunity to not have to go to the emergency room. The target conditions and symptoms that we're aiming to evaluate are chest pain, shortness of breath, palpitations, lightheadedness or passing out. If they need treatment, they can stay here overnight in our observation unit, which has six observation beds, and we can treat and diagnose. We have access to all testing that the hospital offers. The goal, the reason we developed this space is really to change the way in which cardiac care is provided. The advantage to the space is that it does offer same-day immediate access, and that is the novel development. Mm -hmm.